Greetings, this is Ben Murray, Founder and Instructor at the SAS Academy, and welcome to the SAS in 60, where I teach the basics of a SAS metric or concept in 60 seconds. Today's topic, SAS Revenue Recognition. Revenue Recognition's core principle states that one should only record revenue when it has been earned, not when a related invoice has been posted or related cash collected. And in the U.S., we are following guidance from ASC 606, and I won't read this, but with 606, it is a framework. It doesn't tell us exactly how we should do it in detail. It's a framework that we apply to our financial framework within our business to recognize the revenue based on our revenue streams. However, it does follow a five-step revenue recognition process. The first is to identify the contract with the customer. What exactly did we sell? Identify the performance obligations. What are we now obligated to do to deliver or to perform? Determine the transaction price, so a clear selling price in the contract. Allocate the transaction price to each performance obligation, and then recognize revenue when each performance obligation is satisfied. So typically in SaaS, we have a conversion process. So first we have a booking. So we have a signed software contract by both parties. So we have an executed contract to deliver goods or services. Then based on that contract and the payment terms, we invoice the customer for the software and our services. Now remember at this point, we do not have revenue yet. Next, we have to apply revenue recognition. Can we recognize that revenue instantly when we invoice the customer? Or do we have to apply some framework? For example, recognizing the revenue over time that's common within SaaS companies. So quick deferred revenue example. So let's say we invoice a customer for a one year $12,000 subscription. We have not earned this revenue yet, so we have to debit accounts receivable for $12,000 and then we credit our liability section deferred revenue for $12,000. You notice we don't have any P&L interaction yet. We have not earned this revenue yet. We have to now perform a service, deliver a good, a good to recognize this revenue. In SAS, right, commonly recognizing revenue over time. And remember, invoicing or cash receipts does not mean revenue recognition. And make sure you consult with a licensed CPA firm knowledgeable in SAS business if you have specific questions about recognizing your revenue streams. To learn more about this metric and other metrics, check out the sasacademy.com and the sascfo.com.